If you live in New England or the greater Northeast, it's harder to drive anywhere without seeing a Yukon bumper sticker on someone's car. Since December alone, Yukon has sent its football team to a bowl game for the first time in seven years, been nationally ranked in baseball and hockey, and not least of which won the men's basketball national championship. Even setting all of that aside, Yukon is considered to be a public ivy, as it is one of the best public colleges to get an education at. However, whether you are a student stressing over finals, an athlete competing at home or away, or my friend's old neighbors setting off fireworks in their backyard to celebrate the championship, chances are you haven't asked yourself a very simple question. Where is Yukon exactly? It's in stores, some may say. Others just say it's in Mansfield. Some say stores Mansfield. But what is the difference between these two entities? When is one in Mansfield but not in stores? Can one be in stores without being in Mansfield? Is there a mayor of stores? These are the questions that we are trying to answer. This documentary chronicles myself and Quentin as we risk our lives to answer the great question. All right, I've tracked down someone who I think might know about who the mayor of stores is. It's that guy over there. Just gotta ask him a couple questions. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, do you know about the mayor of stores? Uh, no, I don't. You know? No. Well, I've been. I was. Uh, I was looking into it, and it, I was. I was told that you knew something about that. I don't know what you're talking about, man. Listen, I'm a journalist. It's okay, you can talk to me. That's it, I don't know what you're talking about, dude. Like, I got finals and stuff to go to. Like, you yeah. got finals? Yeah. I thought your last final ended today. Um, uh, I told you, I don't know. No, you don't. <laughs> he got away. He's fast. But we know he knows something, otherwise he wouldn't have run away. We gotta, Quentin, we gotta keep looking. Of course. We can't give up now. No, we can't. This is. We're on the cusp. We're on the cusp. We gotta know what's up. We... Something's up. Something. It's fishy. I'm about to faint. Can you catch me? Yeah, sure. Can here you go. catch See that sign over there says downtown stores. But then that sign right there says Mansfield. Now that might lead you to believe that the boundary is between those two flags somewhere. But there's another flag over there that says downtown stores and another one way over there that says Mansfield. What's going on here? What is the, what deal? Is the deal? What is this? All right, we're gonna interview Michael Reed, a local resident. Where is he? Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh 
Oh my gosh. Are you ready to be interviewed? Uh, sure, sure. Yeah. Okay, yeah. let's do this. All right. Hi, I'm Reverend Michael Reed, uh, local geology uh, expert here at Stores, uh, town historian, as some might call me, and uh, a member of the blue team in Pokemon Go. Oh. Uh, and I'm joined by. Uh, I'm Tanner Marchese. Um, I'm a student in uh, political science, uh, local improv <clears throat> member, um, sophomore class representative, and um, oh of, of the Yukon marching band. And oh, I. Um, Wait, who's doing this here? I'm doing the interview, but that was a long interview. I just want to have my credentials. I'm Quentin, cameraman, trumpet player, marching band, digital media and design. We just have a simple question for you. Uh, sure. Where does Mansfield end and stores begin, or stores end and Mansfield begin? I know that, at least in my mind, stores extends to the post office, and maybe a little bit further. Okay. You know, there's a um, let me look. There's a firehouse just down the road, which could give us some information here. We're on a... Uh... Oh, so, so you see this church right here. First Baptist Church of... Mansfield. Mansfield, and that's Spring Hill Road right there, which takes you to Mansfield Middle School, I believe. So that is definitely Mansfield. Interesting. So we're on Storrs Road. The fire department before uh, B. Blaine. Mansfield Fire Department, station here at 7. What do we think of that? Huh? Well, I think that my personal view, as someone who's been studying this issue for quite some time now, stores could also describe the road. Like, stores road is not always in stores, similar to how the Colorado River is not always in Colorado. Yeah, absolutely. Um, like, for example, the inn on stores, I always thought, that's weird. It's That doesn't look like it's in stores. It's not in stores, it's on stores. It's on stores of the road not in stores the town is the what's the the name of the the it's inn the, on the stores, inn on stores. It's on stores road it's on yeah it's on stores it's interesting interesting uh, we have a it, 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 yeah very well, so as as a resident of someone who lives on the street of stores road uh technically my address says mansfield center so this is just something to put into consideration so is mansfield center is that's a separate that's a separate thing i guess so we and as, as a non-resident of Connecticut, I have no idea what's going on. You know, is, uh, there of course. A, is there even a store's fire department? It's very interesting because up here, this is Discovery Drive here. Right. And this is Charter Road Apartments, which in my mind, I'd say that's that's stores. I mean, it's got yeah. stores. I mean, Horse Park Hill is just over here. But you look over here, what's this? Mansfield, Mansfield Supply. Supply. And I feel like as a business owner, if I had the opportunity to make my name alliterative, so like store supply, store supply double S, would. I absolutely would. But he couldn't for fear of like, I mean, like false advertising. If he was indeed in, in, because like what? Yeah. So I'm trying to find businesses that are stores indeed, but you can't find them outside of really, really like downtown stores or stores center. Maybe the business owners are trying to invade the territory, make you think you're yeah. Mansfield, make you pledge your yeah. allegiance. Maybe, maybe there is no Mansfield. Maybe it's all stores. I think that sounds. I don't know about that. Well, like the problem, it's the problem is that there's a sign that says "Welcome to Mansfield" as you're driving up the 195. Well, the other problem is when you're in downtown stores. We just looked. There are flags that say downtown stores, and there are other flags that say Mansfield. So which is it? Right now, are we in Mansfield or are we in stores? I, I think definitively right now we are, we are in stores. We are in stores. What if we went to like E.O. Smith? If uh, we cross the street, would we still be in stores? You, I believe you would still be in stores if you went across to E.O. Smith. Okay. Okay. Now, as I zoom out on my, my map here, which I'm putting a high value of trust in, oh, geez. I keep zooming out. Do you see Mansfield popping up? No, I see no, Mansfield I see Center. Mansfield Center. A few miles down Mansfield. the road. I mean, I see Mansfield Center. I see Willimantic, but I don't see stores. Does Mansfield exist? <laughs>
like a front. Alien made up. I just. Hello, my name is Sophia Lebron, a reluctant uh, rising senior as we are entering finals. Yeah. All right, so where does scores end and Mansfield begin? If we're going to start with when you go past the Yukon sign entering campus by W lot, I would say that's probably where stores begins. Okay. And if I had to guess where stores ends, I would argue that it is where um, Price Chopper okay. ends, that intersection, and that's where Mansfield begins. So, so if you look across the street there, mm -hmm. is that... Is that stores or is that man Mansfield? I <laughs> or is, and, and I'll ask you this, we know that's downtown stores, but is downtown stores the, even really a part of stores? Or is it the Or is it just a part of Mansfield? And the Yukon campus is the really only, the only real stores. I guess Yukon campus would have to be the only real stores, because it is, we call it downtown stores, but it truly is the beginning of Mansfield as okay. they have the Mansfield, uh, and also, when you're locking into the Wi-Fi over here, like at Dog Lane, you have to click on Public Mansfield Wi-Fi. Yeah. So and there are flags there that say Mansfield, and that garbage can says City of Mansfield on it. I would also argue that most of this was Mansfield, but Yukon is stores, and the more that Yukon pushes out, the more stores seems to encroach on Mansfield so, territory. So, so stores... Mansfield is like an ever-shrinking thing. And stores, so as stores grows, Mansfield shrinks. Yes. Or, but when you're in stores, are you also in Mansfield? Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. So Mansfield doesn't really shrink. It's just, in your view, a greater and greater portion of Mansfield becomes stores. I do agree with that statement. That's but I, don't, I wouldn't even know where stores and Mansfield begins because we're thinking about it in the... I think what is this 195 starting from the Yukon going yeah. down to a yeah. big Y but we haven't even thought about is that north versus if that's south that's, then that's south, that's east and west parts of campus where yeah. there's stores and Mansfield that's a whole end. that's a whole nother can of worms <laughs> I got, like, my mind doesn't work in those two directions like it like like I, I live in alumni but when I go out the back to those houses is that Mansfield or is that stores do they live in stores well, it might be Coventry I think that's the other half because I think Mansfield goes south, but Coventry is west. Oh, geez, this is. We're, we've rent to uncharted territory. We might have to go to the library to read about this. More library reading. Mm -hmm. yeah. We've done two interviews, done yeah. a lot of reading, and yep. we almost assaulted someone. But we still don't know definitively the boundary between stores it's, and Mansfield. It's very unclear. Like, is is Yukon stores itself, or is Mans what is Mansfield? Does it even exist? Is there a difference between Mansfield Center and Mansfield? Is, and is, is Mansfield a part of the aliens? Is downtown stores? <laughs> even really part of stores or is it just part of Mansfield because I see no government buildings in downtown stores these questions we were not able to find answers to but hopefully you the viewer can find them yourself
back down someone who I might be able to think. Okay, cut, cut. Um, no, 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 okay, I didn't do it yet. Uh, I didn't. Okay. Now go. Okay. You ready? Yeah. Alright, testing. Speak louder. Testing, testing. Is this working? Oh, I show up for you. Okay, let's do this. So, I'm here. Shut that off. You're interrupting the interview. It's the We're both, we're both off. So, so where it, what is the boundary between stores and Missing the part where I'm supposed to introduce myself. Okay. Come on, Tanner. Alright. Ask Please introduce yourself to the camera. Alright. Of the Yukon marching band. And I'm doing it, but... That was a long intro. I just want my credentials. They need my credentials. I don't need all that. We don't need <laughs> <just come> <laughs>